most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It's Barcelona. They face Arsenal live right here on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. It's Barcelona up against Arsenal. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? the starting 11 for Barcelona Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal Cristiano Ronaldo starts with Lionel Messi in the wide midfield positions and leading the line today is Erling Haaland This is the Arsenal starting 11. William Saliba starts alongside Gabriel in central defence. Leandro Trossard plays with Bukayo Saka on the flanks. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Champions League final we're about to find out which team is the best in Europe Jorginho Saka how about the cross Let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Well, Barcelona get things going again. A wake-up call for them, perhaps. A good idea, but overhit. Kai Havertz. Not high quality defending. Holland and Bellingham. Messi. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. Putting his body on the line. And threaded through by Mbappe. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. Well, that's so tight, isn't it? But on this occasion, he doesn't get the benefit of the doubt.
promising possibilities. Holland. And it's through here. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made from moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, here we can see it again. And he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. So in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Havertz. Times they make passing look easy and nicely parried away. It will be Arsenal's corner as they try to nudge in front of this game. They're going for the short one and a useful cross. just to get a different angle on the cross but look at the defenders they lose their concentration become sloppy with their marking and as a result they find the ball in the back of their net just not good enough well 2-1 it is here stuff from Arsenal and it will be an Arsenal free kick Emphasis on the clearance, a good one Misfiring completely Yeah, he's gone for power but the contact was never right It's a poor effort really for Arsenal and we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here Arsenal's free kick here well now he's walking on eggshells you might say next time it'll be yellow Cross work out for them. And the attack fizzling out. The first half here comes to an end. Back underway with Barca hoping to find an effective route back into the game. And he takes on the shots. Well, Arsenal have lost the ball here. Well, no point in stopping play. Advantage with them. Can he find the right pass? 
able to skip past his man. Opportunity here, and the keeper to the rescue. Well, he takes some beating, that's for sure. It really is a top-class save. Well, the referee allowed them to continue, but now he's got to go back and hand out the yellow card, Stuart. Well, he thought he was going to get away with that, but quite rightly, he's got a booking. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. And over comes the corner. Last man back, and job done. And diving to thwart it. Corner once more. <laughs> Who can they pick out? Well, it has come to nothing. Saliba. Oh, in with a chance! And really top-notch goalkeeping. Well, what can you say? That is absolutely brilliant from the keeper. And they're making a change. And opting for the short corner. Gabriel Jesus, vigorous defending. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Holland. Passes like that, very much in his repertoire. Well, nothing productive, really. Crossing possibilities. And no worries for the goalkeeper. Well, there's the stats, and it's quite clear that Barcelona haven't been good enough in the top third of the pitch. Because some of it... And Ronaldo just needs to remain level-headed. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. Well, here it is again. What a ball that is over the top of the defence. It's weighted perfectly, and Ronaldo finishes it so much quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal. Back underway, dead level, 2-2. White. It's with Erdogan. Jesus. And Barcelona have possession again. Bellingham. Ben White. Another play then. Barcelona throw coming up. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Well, his throwing radar was a bit ill. Must take the lead here. And not cleared away properly. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Well, how many times has he pulled off saves like that? At crucial times as well. What a keeper to Stegen is. Well, on the back of that breathtaking piece of goalkeeping, can they keep the ball and create? Ronaldo lost it. They might be able to get in now. Crossing towards the far post. Oh, what a moment! What a huge moment to potentially win the Champions League. A goal they will never forget. A goal for history. Well, just listen to this noise. What drama we've got here. Surely that has to be the winner. Absolutely brilliant stuff.
Well, the game has been reached. A magical moment for Arsenal fans everywhere. Your old club have just been crowned champions of Europe. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Arsenal, the winners of the UEFA Champions League. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. And now for the photographs that will surely stand the test of time. And what a great achievement for this club. And these are photos that are going to be cherished for a long time to come.